I said at the end of the last one that I might record more immediately after, and it turns out that that's true. Welcome back to Pokemon Omega Ruby. Once again, our first stop in a video is the Space Center. It's a bit of a back and forth here we've got going on in this ye old post game. The link cable was stolen, so our friends at the Devon Corporation can't trade their Alakazam and, I mean, Kadabra and uh, Haunter so that they evolve. And that's just no good, so we have to go bother Team Magma about it. Speaking of, mission start! Well, okay. Nice to confirm that they're here. But we knew that. So does this mean we're gonna have to run through the Space Center as there's a bunch of, like, Team Magma grunts stationed around like, like in the museum earlier, or are they just gonna, like, horde battle me right now? Because there's, like, five of them. In, just in case of that, I think I will... Let's move my party around a little bit. Hey, schmucks. Hee hee hee! We finally meet again! It's been three... How long has it been? Didn't come poop? It doesn't matter! Brace yourself, we won't let you call us mere quintuplets. I thought so. I called it. Oh god, that is a lot of intimidate. <laughs> Luckily, I accidentally planned for this as well. Joe's attack fell. 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 I appreciate this joke. Uh, now, uh, now die. Drown in Joe's wrath! <laughs> oh, I got a critical hit on one of them. Or maybe all of them? I'm not sure how that works. Oh, no! We lost again! We n I knew we would lose. I wanted to win in style like the Hoenn Rangers. It's odd. That strategy, intimidate five times in a row, should be... <laughs> should be invincible. Did you cheat? Nincapoop? You're strong, aren't you? Stop whining. Courtney's on the second floor. It's pathetic, but we can't stop her. Please, please help her. That's... no. Oh, they're just gonna keep saying that. Okay. Oh, wait, no. Wait, I, I should have talked to this, this kind lady here. I shouldn't have let any scoundrels go upstairs, but I'm petrified and can't move. You're having a rough day. Your timing is impeccable, as always, Brina. Team Magma, what do you intend to do with that device? You do realize this is the last hope we have of saving this planet. Dots. Last. Hope. Ha ha. Ah ha ha. Ah ha ha. My team. The team I put all my hope into. Leader Maxi was broken. He was broken. Broken by this brat! How convenient it must be for you to put all the blame on another. Grr! Shut up! Enough! I've had enough of this world! Aha! I know. Inside that rocket is the same amount. No, even more Pokemon life energy than what powered the ultimate weapon in the war 3,000 years ago. Do you get to be a Team Magma admin by paying attention in history class? What? Ah ha ha! I think we're in for an impact so big it will surpass the massive explosion that ended that war. I don't know what all this talk of the meteoroid is, but I have no need of it. Here, by my own hand, I'll make this rocket explode and bring an end to this world. I will fix Project Azoth. Of course, I'll also destroy this dimensional shifter that's supposed to warp the asteroid away someplace, too! 
Sabrina. This fool, this incredible fool, really intends to do it. I'm going to stand here and yell at you instead. If we don't stop this now, our whole world will be embroiled in the destruction. You're ready to battle, aren't you? Um, yes. Don't get in my way. Team Magma Grunt has nothing to add to this. Magma Ad and Courtney, and some random schmo. Oh man, I guess I'm going to hurt Steven Scarmory. Whatever shall I do? Yeah, I expected that. I was thinking, you better Mega Evolve, come on. Come on. And so you did. I guess the Mighty Inna serving as like an intimidation... Wow. The fact that that killed Mega Camerupt but not Mighty Inna is kind of funny, even though I know that Mega Camerupt is like extremely weak. Why are you using Spike? Oh yeah, she does have a second Pokemon. There were three, there were three balls in their court. Oh wait, no, the Grunt has the second Pokémon? What is this garbage? Courtney, it's so easy to get in your way, you have no idea. Joe has reached the Great 7-0. Skarmorio flails its wings about for no reason. Pokemon does Steven have, I wonder? Maybe we'll find out if Weezen kills him. I'm using Waterfall so that I don't kill him. I don't think Steel's very good against... Actually, why would Steel be bad against Poison when Steel is immune to Poison? I should think before I say words. This isn't killing you fast enough because of Intimidate. I guess I'll let Steven get the killing blow. It would have been funny if that missed. Team Magma continues to suck. Just barely. You're crazy strong, like always. Why? Why must you always, 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 always get in my way? Darn! Dang it! Dots. Brina, now is the chance! Now's our chance! Take the dimensional shifter and. Huh? <laughs> Wismer, you. Aster used Thief! It's super effective! Aster snatched the dimensional shifter away from Courtney! That Pokemon, doesn't it belong to. Nice one, Aster! Time for my theme song! You're the... The Draconid, yep, or you could just call me Zinnia. Esther! Murr! Thank you, dear! Now then, that is an impressive machine. Snap your fingers, the asteroid vanishes, and we all live happily ever after? Ah, indeed, it's like that former champ said. This thing is the best hope we have of saving this planet and everything on it. But you know, it could also be the worst tragedy imaginable for some other world and everything on it! Hey, I said that as a joke last time! What are you trying to say? I'm not talking to you. You don't get it. <laughs> Burn. Ugh. But you, Brina, you're the protagonist. Hope for our world, tragedy for another. You get it, don't you? Yeah. It... And you come through again. You never disappoint me. My people know it. From generation to generation, we pass along the lore about the distortions in the world born by the mega evolution mechanism and about the existence of another world, which we have long observed to be just like this one, and yet not the same. That's right, a Hoenn region that's almost exactly like this one we live in. Wait, what? So you're saying that we play dimensional tennis with meteors all the time? Filled with Pokemon and people like us. A world where maybe the evolution of Pokemon took a slightly different path. Where Mega Evolution's unknown. A world where that war 3,000 years ago never happened. So is this an alternate timeline, or an alternate dimension? 
Are you talking about the original Ruby and Sapphire, where this backstory part hadn't been canonized yet? A world where the ultimate weapon was never even built? And in the Hoenn of that world, what would happen if one day out of the blue a meteoroid appeared? Well, it would split into three, and depending on which one you interacted with, it would change your Deoxys into attack type, speed type, or defense type. What would happen to the people of that world without the technology to destroy the meteoroid or the power to warp it away? Well... Looks like it's beyond the power of your imagination. Zinnia crushed the dimensional shifter in her hand. You could animate that. What kind of fool are you? You have no substantive proof, and yet you claim another world or one just like our own exists? Of, out of this fantasy, you, you have destroyed our only hope. What have... Done. Farewell, brief hope. Y you do you even know? Now what are we to do? Calm down, there, professor. It'll be okay. I, we, we can protect this world and the other. Who exactly is we? What are your intentions? Oh yeah, silly me. I forgot the other thing I came for. B what? <laughs> Zinnia snatched the keystone away from Courtney. What? Uh, uh. And that's the keystone gotten. Now I'll put it together with the keystone they've got in their base. Murr. Looks like my next appointment is calling, so I'll excuse myself now. Later. Murr. Our leader. Leader Maxie's keystone. Is she trying to steal it? No. No. Confound it all. So she must be making for the Team Magma's hideout next. Think, Steven, think! What to do? What to do? How about we go to Team Magma's hideout? Just a thought? I don't know, Steven, when you got more role in the plot, I don't like you as much. Arr. Okay, you say the same thing. You're probably like, I'm, I just work here, Miss Courtney. You don't have to act tough in front of me. Yeah, okay. You say the same thing. It's no time to lose heart. I've somehow got to find a way to repair the dimensional shifter. She, she didn't take it with her, she just crushed it and threw it on the floor? The problems just keep popping up one after another. We're supposed to be carving out a bright new future with the power of science, but, but this mess... Sigh. Well, sometimes science is not the answer, apparently. Yeah, these Team Magma guys are just gonna hang out here for a while. Okay, now to the Team Magma base. But let's put Stanley back in, in the front for morale. And, uh, Team Magma base, Team Magma base. It's somewhere. It, it's, um, it, it's certainly somewhere, yeah. Uh, Man, I am bad at things. Certain things I am bad at. It, isn't it? Is it in... Is it... I think it's in Lily Cove? Right? Like it's off the shore here? Am I correct in this? I mean, we got a nice beach going on. Yeah, maybe? Perhaps not? I... Hmm. I should probably remember where this important place is. That would probably be helpful. It's not over here, because this is just a lighthouse. Is it like slightly north? Yeah, it's right here, isn't it? Yep, okay, I was right. Team Magma hideout. Hey guys, how's it going? You don't mind if I, uh... 
That trainer with the black bobbed hair, she was incredibly strong. But our leader is beyond the rooms full of work panels. It's not that easy to get there. So Maxie's still hanging out. Woman with the whismer is inside. What is that dragon type Pokemon user? Her strength, it's really something. Is she stronger than Maxie? Um, yes. Because Maxie's a dweeb. So that's pretty much gonna be a yeah. Oh man, it's those warp panels that we really had to explain. Is this stuff I've... Whoa, don't come here, back, get back! Are there new trainers in here to fight, or is this just some schmo I missed? We can find out based on the level of his Pokémon. Oh, I guess they're new. Alright, maybe I should have read that other guy's thing about listening to Maxie's edifying speech at 11 a.m. every morning. Every morning. Oh, right, Sludge Bomb. Stanley can't take a hit very well, can he? You disappoint me a little bit, Stan. I mean, Stanley, not anyone else named Stan. You know who you are. You're fine. Oh no, Stanley's dead! Yeah, whatever. Ever since he evolved, he's just not the adorable, precious mascot he was. What a tragedy. That's like the backstory of at least several anime characters. Except related to being an idol. Like Rise, maybe, from Persona. Except I don't think she evolved. She got older. She got sick of it. I didn't actually play Persona 4, I'd just seen it. Persona Q's pretty good though. I'm getting pretty off topic here. A Numble? He couldn't even be bothered to evolve the dang thing? Come on, man. I expect higher effort out of you. Camerupt evolves before level 49, surely. I was knocked out, out like a light! Huh? You aren't with that girl who uses dragon types? How about that? It was silly of me to be so scared then. Well, I guess I am kind of with her? I'm not really... I'm not clear on that at this point. I mean... Obviously, she's supposed to be the real good guy. Do I not have any revives of any sort? It would seem that that is the case. I guess Stanley gets to stay dead. A refreshing change of pace for him, no doubt. Let's just continue to sweep everything with a mega evolution, then. An intruder? In our hideout? You're pretty shady looking. On our mark, get on your mark, get set, fight! Battle routine, execute! I mean, battle routine set, and then execute. The Team Magma Grunt calls me shady looking. Well, Hey, I don't have a team of six Pokemon at the moment, technically, so I can't make that exact complaint at every single person that I run into that complains about how strong I am. Maybe only the admins have camera up to privileges. That would explain a little bit. Another wheezing. So many wheezings, they're just sacks of hit points. I could use Earthquake, but it has Levitate. Not all Pokémon that appear to be levitating have Levitate, but wheezing does. And, and wheezing's just gonna avoid that attack, I guess. Good job. Hit. Hit. Exciting. 
chop. Oh, only one out of two chops. For a total of three. Beaten at my own game for a second time! Oh, I've beaten you before? I mean, I guess I should assume that for all Team Magma Grunts, but you know. You're not an intruder? Uh, sorry. I thought you were with that girl who was in here messing up our hideout earlier. Earlier? Does that mean she's gone? Did she already get through the teleporter maze? It's really hard to navigate, I guess. I'm not that interested in fighting every single grunt, so I'm just gonna run into teleporters until I get where I'm supposed to be. I don't think it's here. Let's try the stairs. If you want to get to the leader, you'll have to defeat me first! Not that you didn't have a chance! Not that you have a chance even if the whole world went topsy-turvy. What's that supposed to mean? Does that mean that you're going to fight me with a Malamar, even though that's way outside of this region? Because it's it's got the thing topsy-turvy? That's a joke about other Pokemon games. Wait, this mighty unit doesn't have intimidate? I guess that's possible. Okay, I don't need to make it evolve. Be, be honest, self. I mean, there's no reason to not make it evolve other than speed running. It was my Pokemon and I who went all topsy turvy. I. You like that phrase, don't you? What's going on with you and that girl from earlier? I know teenagers can feel frustrated, but that's no reason to go wrecking other people's hideouts. What's that? You're not together? Sorry about that. Do I need to wear, like, a sign around my neck? Hey. Meteorites, natural energy, some ancient Pokemon. Here we're conducting experiments to understand how they all really improve. I think you said that before. That sounds familiar. You're not very good at what you're trying to do, basically. I'm sure I'm missing at least one piece of amusing dialogue from a random grunt. But it will have to be as such. Hey, I have an idea. Let's build a hallway that just has two teleports in it. Did they think about how inconvenient their own maze was? To them? Probably not. Accidentally running in diagonal circles. I slipped up and let that girl defeat me earlier, but I won't go that but it won't go that way all the time. Well, it'll go that way two times in a row. Oh, a Golbat. I say that as if I'm surprised. For whatever reason, I was expecting a second Myena, but I guess not. Time to get chopping. Chop. Chop. Air Slash has pretty... I forgot Air Slash didn't have perfect accuracy. Maybe it's like 85? Maybe I put something on Jenna and I forgot. Time and time again, I'm a man who can't do his job. Now that I get a good look at you, aren't you that kid from the other day? Listen, our leader and Tabitha are in danger. The way that girl handled her, Pokem handled her Pokemon earlier. She might even be better than Tabitha. No, even better than Leader Maxi himself. You know, I wonder if Max is just like, hey, I did some really bad, dumb things, and you're talking about saving the world, so maybe I should just hand you this Megastone, I mean, because it might help. Maybe. If I were Maxi, I would do that, but then again, I probably wouldn't have done all the other stuff that he did. Because he's, he's a jerk. So, you know. Where exactly am I supposed to be going here? Hmm. 
Okay. Oh, we're still in the middle of the scene. Alright. Go! Alright, and the winner is Zinnia! Leader Maxi, please compose yourself. Grr. The great Maxi has fallen to this woman? Murr, murr. Oh, oh, what's this? Aren't you a happy girl, Aster? Just what I'd expect of my daughter. We're so in sync. Ha, ha, ha. The plot twist is that this is actually her biological daughter? I hope not. Woman, who are you? Who am I? That's a surprisingly difficult question. I couldn't become who I was supposed to be, so what does that make me now? Ah, whatever, right? Enough with the introspection and the soul-searching. You there, Brina, don't just stand there like a stick in the mud. Come on over and say hi. Oh, hey. Could it be the child? You, why are you here? Isn't it obvious? She's the heroine, right? You're here to save the world again. Oops, but it looks like she's a bit too late this time. If only you'd been here just one minute earlier. You... Zinnia snatched the keystone away from Maxi. Leader? Alright, I'd say this keystone's mine. We finally got everything, Aster. Mer? Now we can do it! The summoning! We will summon Rayquaza! Oh, okay. Well then, it looks like my job here is done, so don't mind me while I excuse myself. Oh, Bria? I really hope you'll come chasing that for me, you know? We'll be heading to that ancient tower sealed since primal times. The Sky Pillar. If you don't know what that is, well, ask that former champ of yours. He'll know what I'm talking about. See you there! I hope you've made some repairs to that place so I don't have to do some nonsense bike puzzles. But what's going on here? Who does she think that she is, messing up our base and giving us a slip? That can never be forgiven! Now I see. Yes, it was not chance that brought you here now. This was inevitable. Leader? Tabitha, give it to her. What? What did you say? Is that all right? Yes. Now that the keystone has been stolen, a megastone will serve me no purpose. Acknowledged. Camera update! Just what I always didn't want! Camera update. Make sure your camera up holds onto it tightly. I don't have one. I do not have the power now to use Mega Evolution, so I entrust it to you. I entrust it, believing that this is the best action I can now take. That woman. She had such an utter mastery over her Dragon-type Pokémon. There's more to her than meets the eye. I do not know what must be going through her mind, but I think you may be the only one who can now stand a chance against her. Or, who can now stand against her. So I ask you this favor. RAGE! Take up this fight for me, and bring this crisis to its resolution! Okay. Update your dang entry call app already. Are you alright? Is that right? I never even imagined. Wait, didn't you say this was a one-way call? The Keystone, the Sky Pillar, and the Draconid people. So that's it. I begin to see the line connecting these dots. I think we need to meet up at once to discuss what we should do next. I'll be waiting at the Space Center, up on the second floor. Do hurry. <sighs> do I have to manually get out of this dumb hideout? Wait, wait, hang on. Is there a second... Is there a... Emergency exit teleport in the back, maybe? No. Do I have an escape rope? Maybe? Yes? No? Hmm? 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 I do indeed. I have three. This is the time for the- Oh, god dang it, Dad! This is definitely the time for that. I'm in a teleporter maze. Why? Oh wait, that's not correct. Dad, if you had any idea what technology was up to these days, you would let me use... That wasn't right either, was it? Ugh, you'd let me use an escape rope in this stupid waste of time. Oh wait, that was wrong. Ah, I'm getting all confused. Dang it. There we go. That's that. Seriously. 
seriously, did they really need to elaborate on the technology behind these warp points? And heck, if, if this is true, if these warp points are powered by the same technology that that rocket is being powered by, does that mean that the other Hoenn Zinnia was talking about isn't the original games because they still had to teleport? Maybe they invented some alternate teleport technology that they didn't feel like they needed to explain. Maybe they just glued an Abra under e each of the teleporters. I don't know. Yeah, no. It's not time for you, Tinted Whatever. Alright, so... Once more, we go to the Mosteep Space Center. But once more, it's been 30 minutes. So... Join us next time for what is building up to be the thrilling conclusion to the Delta episode. Of course it might not be, I don't know. I guess we'll find out together once I continue to record immediately after this. Running on all of the energy that I have for no reason, especially because I didn't sleep yet. It's like almost 8 in the morning for the record. I was staring at the internet and playing Splatoon, and that's my life. See you next time.